Hi, I'm Laurie Thomas with the University of Kentucky Forestry and Natural Resources Extension, and I'm here with the tree of the week, the shellbark hickory. Caria laciniosa is one of nine hickories native to Kentucky. It is in the Juggalinaceae or walnut family. Shellbark hickory is also called kingnut, bottom shellbark, and western shellbark. This distinctive deciduous tree is slow growing and long lived. Trees can grow up to 80 to 100 feet tall with diameters between 30 and 40 inches. Under forested conditions, it has a straight, clear trunk with a narrow oblong crown, but in open, the trees tend to have an egg shaped crown. It can be confused with shagbark hickory, Caria ovata. Shellbark nuts are the largest of all hickory nuts and enjoyed by wildlife and people alike. The wood is hard, heavy, and strong. Shellbark hickory's range extends from New York, south to Tennessee, and west into Kansas, and while it is widely distributed, it is not very common. In Kentucky, it can be found in most of the state except extreme eastern Kentucky and is one of the most frequent hickories in the inner bluegrass. Shellbark hickory grows on alluvial bottomlands and gentle moist slopes, which are usually areas of crop cultivation, which has contributed to it being uncommon throughout its range. It is very shade tolerant and only exceeded by sugar maple and American beech in tolerance. It tends to have a large taproot, which can make it difficult for transplanting, so it's not widely used in landscape plantings. Shellbark hickory is a deciduous tree with large, alternately arranged, pinnately compound leaves, as you can see in the photo. The leaves usually have seven to nine leaflets that are obovate to lanceolate in shape. They are dark green above and light below and tend to be kind of fuzzy. The leaf rachis may also be fuzzy. Autumn leaf color is golden yellow to brown. This species is monoecious, meaning one house, so the tree will have both male and female flowers. The male flowers are on two to three inch long yellow-green catkins, and the female flowers are on short spikes and clusters at the ends of branches. Flowers appear in mid-spring after the leaves have emerged, and the flowers are wind-pollinated. Shellbark hickory fruit is a large round nut that's about two to two and a half inches across. It's the largest produced by any hickory. It has an extremely thick husk, about up to at least a half an inch in thickness. Inside the husk is a four to six ribbed nut that is sweet and edible. The fruit ripens in autumn between September and November, and trees begin seed production around 40 years of age with best production between 75 and 200 years. Shellbark hickory has good seed crops every, usually every second year, and the seeds are dispersed by gravity, birds, squirrels, and other rodents. Shellbark hickory is very distinctive. On young trees, the bark is smooth and gray with shallow interlacing ridges. As the tree grows, those interlacing ridges develop into long, loose plates, giving the tree a shaggy appearance. Hickory wood is among the hardest and strongest of woods native to the United States, and it has a very high thermal energy content when burned. Shellbark hickory heartwood is light to medium brown with a slight reddish hue, and sapwood tends to be paler yellowish brown. Cut boards with contrasting heartwood and sapwood have a rustic look and are occasionally marketed as calico hickory. It is considered non-durable regarding heartwood decay. Shellbark hickory provides food and habitat for a variety of wildlife. Ducks, quail, wild turkey, deer, squirrel, chipmunk, fox, and mice eat the nuts for food. And the shagbark hickory bark provides roosting sites for a variety of bats. Various species of hickory are lumped together and sold as hickory. The wood is used for furniture, tool handles, sporting equipment, veneer, fuel wood, and charcoal. The burning wood is also used for smoking meats. The national champion shellbark hickory as of 2021 is in Culpeper, Virginia. It is 190 inches in circumference, 109 feet tall, with a 112 foot crown spread. The Kentucky Champion Shellbark Hickory is in Greenup County. It is 163 inches in circumference, 120 feet tall, with a 44-foot crown spread. If you'd like to know more about Champion Trees, check out American Forest Champion Trees or check out the Kentucky Division of Forestry Champion Trees. Now for a few fun facts about shellbark hickory. Caria, the hickory genus, is almost exclusively an American genus, since there is only one other species found in China. The other hickory species of Europe have been extinct since the last ice age. 
Native Americans stored hickory nuts and made hickory milk, which was a nutritious staple of most of their cooking. The common name of shell bark comes from the bark, which appears to peel away from the tree like a shell as it ages. And the other common name, king nut, comes from the, lar the tree's large nuts. Count the number of leaflets to distinguish shell bark from shagbark hickory. Shell bark usually has seven leaflets and shag bark five leaflets. The scientific genus name Caria is from the Greek name for the walnut tree, and the species name Laciniosa means shredded or cleft into narrow divisions, referring to the loosening bark plates. Thanks for joining me to learn about this super native tree, the shell bark hickory, and I hope you get the opportunity to get out into your woodland, a local park or neighborhood, and enjoy our native trees.